Yes, Python. What's good, people? We are back again. EastEnders Rap Roundup number ninety-four. For those of you who don't know, this is a one-minute roundup of what I've seen of the week so far of EastEnders, people. Before I do start, I would like to give some shout-outs: Lenny Bridges, Michelle Burke, and Little Lexi May, Warren Agius, Ebony Bourne, and to George Keneally. Thank you very much for your continued support, guys. I really do appreciate that, and I hope you'll continue to support me in the future. Thank you. If any of you guys would like a shout-out, just remember all you've got to do is subscribe to me and drop me a message, and you'll get a shout-out in the next round. So check it out, and I hope you enjoy. Share. Times were hard for Ian and Jane because Bobby had decided to run away. Because he'd worked on Lucy's case, but Masood then found him and he was safe. And then Bobby told Jane he's feeling sad because he now wants to live with his dad. But he wants Jane to move back so they can all be together at last. Cindy's feeling down and low because she don't think that she can cope. To take care of Beth on her own, she felt like she's losing hope. Jane and Ben were more than stressed because Denise found a clue on Lucy's death. And it was hard evidence that could have got them to a jail sentence. Linda told these straight that a kid's not his to keep him away. Keep the game in play, that's something to remember. Python, right round up, EastEnders. Yes, EastEnders, right round up number 94. Thank you for watching, people. Please subscribe to the channel. That way, you can be the first to see the future coming right round ups. Work in progress, volume 1 is out right now. Check that out. Until next time, it's Python signing out. Peace. Cindy's feeling down and low because she do not think that she can cope. To take care of Beth on her own, so she felt like she's losing hope. That's part. <laughs>